Introducing the rebellious and rock-inspired hero Hobby Brown, also known as Spider-Punk. Join us on an exhilarating journey as we delve into the evolution of Spider-Punk across video games, television, and movies. Make sure to stay till the end for our Spider-Punk bonus reveal. As usual, we have hidden the Joker somewhere in the video, and the first viewer to spot him and comment down below will earn a shout-out in our upcoming video. So first up on our list, we have Spider-Punk from the Spider-Man Unlimited mobile game from 2014. Spider-Man Unlimited is an endless runner mobile game developed and published by Gameloft, based on the iconic Marvel character Spider-Man. The game was released in 2014 and offered players a thrilling experience of controlling Spider-Man and his alternate versions as they battled against the infamous Sinister Six across various dimensions. The game features a mix of endless runner gameplay and story mode missions, providing a well-rounded gaming experience for Spider-Man fans. One of the unique features of Spider-Man Unlimited is the inclusion of various alternate versions of Spider-Man from different dimensions. Players can collect these alternate Spider-Man versions as cards through portals. Each version comes with its own unique abilities and powers, allowing players to assemble a diverse team of Spider-Man. Spider-Punk is one of the alternate Spider-Man versions featured in Spider-Man Unlimited. As a rock star with Spider-Powers, he brings a unique and rebellious twist to the game's roster of Spider-Man. In the game, Spider-Punk uses his electric guitar and web abilities to deal significant damage to enemies and take them down with style. Next up, we have Spider-Punk from the television series Ultimate Spider-Man Season 4 2016. In the TV show, Marvel Ultimate Spider-Man Season 4, there is an episode titled Return to the Spider-Verse Part 4. The episode follows Spider-Man and Kid Arachnid as they venture through various alternate dimensions to collect the shattered pieces of the Siege Perilous. In the episode, Spider-Man successfully gathers all the shards of the Siege Perilous and confronts a villain known as Wolf Spider. The intense confrontation takes place in the universe of Miles Morales. Along the way, Spider-Man and Kid Arachnid encounter numerous alternate versions of themselves and other characters. In the episode, Wolf Spider captures several different Spider-Man versions, and one of the captured Spider-Mans is Spider-Punk. Next up on our list, we have Spider-Punk from the Marvel Strike Force game 2018. Marvel Strike Force released in 2018 and in an alternate universe within the game's storyline, Hobart Brown, a homeless teenager gains superhuman powers after being bitten by a radioactive spider involved in toxic waste dumping orchestrated by President Norman Osborn. As Spider-Punk, he becomes a symbol of rebellion, leading a revolt against Osborn's regime and ultimately defeating him in a climactic battle where he showcases the power of his electric guitar. Spider-Punk wields his electric guitar and web abilities to deal significant damage and incapacitate enemies on the battlefield. Spider-Punk's abilities and unique design make him a valuable addition to the Web Warrior team in Marvel Strike Force. He synergizes well with other Web Warrior allies, especially in raids where his abilities can chain to multiple targets and inflict debilitating effects like trauma and heal block. Moreover, his punk rock persona and electric guitar attacks make him a standout character among the roster, offering players a fresh and exciting gameplay experience. Next up, we have Spider-Punk from Marvel's Spider-Man 2018 game, Marvel's Spider-Man is a critically acclaimed action-adventure video game developed by Insomniac Games and published by Sony Interactive Entertainment. It was released on September 7, 2018, exclusively for the PlayStation 4. In the game, the Spider-Punk suit outfit is part of the Spidey Suit Pack pre-order bonus, granting instant access to three unique suits. For players who didn't pre-order, the suit can be unlocked at level 16 by spending two backpack tokens, three crime tokens, and two landmark tokens. The suit comes with the Rockout suit power. When swinging through the streets of New York City with the Spider-Punk suit equipped, players trigger the Just the Facts episode titled Spider-Punk. In this episode, John Jonah Jameson harshly criticizes Spider-Man's choice of outfit, wondering if there might be more than one Spider-Man, and if this one is just a copycat. Some sort of punk rock inspired thing that makes sane people want to tear out their eyeballs with a rusty spoon. Now, I was around for the birth of punk rock, and I did not care for it then. It's a flagrant declaration of disrespect for authority, and a Spider-Man is going down that route. The Spider-Punk suit features a red and blue color scheme with stylish white highlights. 
Unlike the traditional boots, it has sneakers and its headpiece boasts spikes resembling a mohawk. While there's no spider insignia on the front, the back of the top bears a spider insignia with the letters FNSM, representing friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Completing the look are punk rock bracelets and a punk rock belt, adding to the suit's edgy appeal. As for its suit power, the rockout ability allows Spider-Man to unleash a powerful attack. With a one-two punch from his guitar, enemies are first sent skyward by the initial blast and then propelled backward by the continuing waves, creating a devastating impact. And the last one on our list before our bonus reveal is Spider-Punk from Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse movie 2023. In the animated film, Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, Spider-Punk takes on a prominent role as one of the notable Spider-Man versions and is voiced by the talented Daniel Kaluuya. In the movie, Spider-Punk plays a significant role in the storyline. He forms a bond with Gwen Stacy and joins forces with her and other alternate Spider-Heroes to assist Miles Morales. Together, they embark on a multiverse-traveling mission to confront various challenges and adversaries. In terms of powers, Spider-Punk possesses the traditional spider-like abilities, such as a spider sense that alerts him to danger and the ability to emit shockwave attacks using his guitar. Additionally, he is depicted as a tech genius, having created a dimension-hopping watch that aids in their interdimensional travels. Throughout the film, Spider-Punk's character evolves as he grows closer to his fellow Spider-Heroes and learns the importance of teamwork and friendship. And now, for our bonus reveal. We have gathered the most interesting facts you probably didn't know about Spider-Punk. So here we go with some fast facts about Spider-Punk you probably didn't know. Spider-Punk made his first appearance in The Amazing Spider-Man Vol. 10 in January 2015. Originally designed as the UK's Spider-Man, he eventually became Earth-138 Spider-Punk, further distinguishing him from other versions of Spider-Man. Spider-Punk hails from Earth-138, a dystopian alternate reality where Norman Osborn is the president and where Spider-Punk is a freedom fighter who fights oppression and rebels against the fascist government. His name is a reference to the punk rock band The Ramones. His catchphrase is Spider-Man Anarchy. He is a fan of the band Green Day. His favorite food is pizza. He is immune to Spider-Man's spider sense. He has a rock band called the Spider Slayers. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe for more videos.